Occasionally, a customer will report an incident in which a filter cracks while in use. In many instances, these cracks are located in or near a dent in the filter can. Fluid pumps typically force fuel or lubricant through a system in controlled pulses. Filter cans are designed to equally distribute the force created by these pulses, as the filter removes contaminants from the system. When a can becomes dented, a concentration of stress is created. Smaller dents tend to localize the stress point more so than larger dents. Larger dents, to a degree, reform the can's shape, thereby equalizing some of the stress concentration. Whether small or large, the result is the dented area begins to flex with the pulses. Over time, the filter's metal may become fatigued, leading to a crack or a fatigue fracture in the filter. Filters that are dented during or prior to installation should not be used. Most spin-on filters can be installed by hand. This eliminates the possibility of dents from installation tools such as filter wrenches. These tools are primarily intended to aid in the removal of spin-on filters after use. If a tool is absolutely necessary for filter installation, ensure that the midsection of the filter is not gripped. This region of the can is more susceptible to damage from a tool. The area that is least likely to be damaged by a filter wrench is located at the bottom of the can near the base plate. It is important to remember, however, that over-torquing the filter can still result in dents and consequently fatigue fractures. Filters dented after installation should be replaced immediately upon detection in order to avoid potential damage and costly repairs.